Now, thousands of homes have been impacted. We've seen in many of the video cars just stranded on the highway, even in some parking lots. Yeah, many of those flood damaged vehicles will be sent to the junkyard, but some may end up back on the used car market. Alex George joins us live again this morning to show you what you need to be looking for if you're shopping for a used car. Hey, good morning, Dan and Lauren. Now, most vehicles that make it back on the used car market, they'll be flagged so that buyers know exactly what they're getting into when they purchase that vehicle. But unfortunately, after Hurricane Sandy, after the major flooding in Texas earlier this year, there were reports of sellers trying to get rid of flood damaged cars, but they weren't disclosing that information. So what do you need to know if you're doing some online shopping for a used car? Well, we talked about in the five o'clock hour, the Ohio Attorney General's office recommends using the VIN number to do vehicle checks on the history of the car. Now, if everything checks out, but you're still feeling a little bit unsure, there are some things you can check out on the inside of the car. I talked with Haas Auto Group in Canfield and they suggested look at the material on the car. Do you see any unusual water stains? Check out the carpet. Do you see any mold, any mildew smells underneath? And check unusual places for dirt and mud. They said check out the glove box. Do you see any sand, anything that looks unusual in places that it shouldn't be? Every car that we get, we check for all those types of things. We look for any kind of damage. Uh, when you have a car up in the air, you can look for uh, mud in the wrong places. Uh, you can look under the dash. Uh, and a, a lot of times when they clean these cars for a cell, they try to clean them as best they can, but they can't always get up in the dash. Now, Jeff recommends anytime you're buying a used car, Take it to a reputable dealer. Have them check out the car just to make sure everything looks okay and to make sure that the car you bought uh, is running properly. Now, all of this information, including a link to where you can get a Carfax, that's on our website, WKBN.com.